Steve Moore with his uh, wonderful musical friend singing a song that Jimmy McCarthy wrote titled Ride On uh, off an album of his that he put out in, a, in the mid-90s uh, titled The Voyage. So information about what's happening in the Wairapa this coming week. There's a very exciting range of activities. We've got belly dance for beginners. That's this evening in Featherston at the community centre, 6.30 to 7.30. If you want to find out about that, you call Antonia uh, on 021 105 7649 sorry, 021-105-7649 to join in with the belly dance for beginners class. Um, also this evening, at the, Cart the Carterton Community Choir is meeting at the Carterton Primary School Hall. Uh, a wonderful group of very uh, passionate singers uh, led by Stephen Judd, uh, well known to most of us. And um, that's a choir that you can join. I don't know that you can go along and just listen to them practicing, but they do performances at times and they're well looking out for. So that's 7.15 to 9 o'clock at the Carterton School Hall on Holloway Street. Um, also today, the Masterton Patunk Club are out, weather permitting, uh, 2 o'clock, Queen Elizabeth Park and their Patunk court is right beside the outdoor bowls uh, which is also often very busy uh, most of the week and on the weekends and of course it's right next to Coco the dessert bar where we will be tomorrow night um, staying with Thursday the, the Waka Ori Ori uh, Shufflers who are a line dancing group meet at the Red Star Club rooms on Herbert Street 1 to 2.30 this afternoon so if you like line dancing head along to the Waka Ori Ori uh, Shufflers group um, let's see golly lots of time for ums what about telling you about the Wairapa Fern and Thistle Pipe Band practice all of you would be pipers and probably some drummers um, head along to the Savage Club Hall 10 Albert Street, Masterton, for the Wairapa Fern and Thistle Pipe Band practice, 6.30 to 8.30 tonight. Moving on to Friday, um, there is one of Yonish's community music co-creation Farnanga uh, group meetings in the Featherston Community Centre at 6.30 tomorrow night. That's going to compete with us, but not to worry, because Yonish uh, is a much more interactive um, participatory musical experience than we can offer uh, good for kids who are keen to start learning music and a wonderful community experience so he does that all over the Wairapa and even now I see he's doing these groups in Wellington but there's one on Friday night at 6.30 at the Featherston Community Centre also tomorrow night we have Wayne Heath playing at the uh, Club Wairarapa um, old rock and roll, rockabilly, uh, a bit of blues thrown in and no doubt a heap of country from Wayne Heath. 7.30, uh, members and guests, Club Wairapa in Essex Street. He's also competing with us, but not to worry. Uh, I'm, I'm sure there are people who, who are welcoming Wayne back into the community. Um, i just say one more thing about Friday and then we're going to move on to some music. Um, this is to tell you about the Needlework and Craft Drop-In at 10 o'clock tomorrow, the Featherston Community Centre, followed up by the Cloth Collective Sewing Workshop, um, and that's at the Featherston Community Hall uh, tomorrow, starting at 10 o'clock and going through till 2 in the afternoon. Jonathan, Hello. I think it's time for us to have some songs and, and, and music. Let me get my guitar. Let me strap this on. Oh, we go. So, Jonathan, I'll let you just talk a little bit about yeah. about your creation. Okay. So, um, 
a few months ago, I saw uh, an advertisement uh, online for, now what's this thing that I'm doing called? Uh, this thing you're doing, um, the fellowship. Fellowship, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, what's, it, what's its full name? It's the uh, Cross Creek Blues Club Carterton District Council F Music Fellowship. There you go, you see why. Under the auspices of the New Zealand Pacific Studio. Exactly, exactly. So that's the vehicle for it. What he said, folks, that's the thing that I'm doing. Uh, so I, I applied to that, I sent my CV and a, a kind of proposal. Uh, and I was lucky and I've been out here staying uh, out at a place called Frog Farm, which is fabulous, uh, near Gladstone, uh, and writing music, basically. Um, songs that have been inspired uh, by the environs and circumstances that I found myself in, uh, and tunes that have been at least written here. So... Um, uh, I am, uh, when I'm at home, uh, I do a lot of Irish music. Um, I am a loyal and basically faithful member of the Welsh Dragon Irish Session in Wellington, in Courtney Place. I've been playing accordion with some of those musicians for about 20 years, accordion, tin whistle, um, and I sing If There's No Alternative. Um, there is going to be no alternative quite soon. Um, so uh, a lot of the stuff that I write uh, is basically jigs, reels, polkas, hornpipes uh, and uh, waltzes as well. Mm. So I'm going to play, we're going to play a set of tunes here. Uh, first one is called the Frog Farm Waltz. Uh, you can tell it's a waltz because it goes um pa pa. And then I'll slide into some jigs. Um, the first jig is not one that was written out here. Actually, it just happens to be in the right key. Uh, it's called Mr. and Mrs. James. This is for two very good friends of mine, uh, Ruth and Andrew. Um, shout out to you. You won't be listening, but this is for you. And then, uh, I guess, a frog farm jig to follow up. Another jig. So two sets of two jigs and a waltz to begin with. It goes a bit like this. So I'll just start it. You're you, starting yeah. on Frog Farm Waltz? Yes, I am indeed. Yeah, you're going to play the first two? I'll play the first bit. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Cool.
Frog Farm Wilson, a couple of jigs. Jonathan, we're underway. Yes, we are. Oh, yes, we've got a song. We've got, we got a song. We're going to do 40 years. Yes. This is yes. a beautiful song, folks. Jonathan, again, will give you the intro. So, um, this uh, was not actually written out here. This is one, I don't know, it's some years ago. I should do the maths. I should have done the maths before, but that's all right. Um, it's it's called 40 Years, and it was written uh, for my parents. They were coming up to their 40th anniversary, uh, and they said, look, Jonathan, you've written songs for all kinds of people and all kinds of situations. Do you think you could write a song for our anniversary celebrations? Uh, there was quite a do. They don't normally do a do. They don't normally have a party for their anniversary, but this was actually a party. And so I wrote a song, and me, and my sisters, and sister-in-law, and brother-in-law, and wife and family. We all played this to my parents, and it's all true. <laughs> Years on down the tracks How does it feel when you turn around and look back? Forty years, forty years to discover How to love, how to understand each other And do you wonder where the time has gone? It doesn't seem like anything is lost as forty years Forty years since the day that you were wed Forty years sleeping in one bed Forty years living at the same address Forty years, forty years, cleaning up the children's mess And do you wonder where the time has gone? It doesn't seem like anything as long as forty years Doing all those years ago For better or for worse You said how could you really know In sickness or in health They were the very words you said But look around and see Just where your promises have down the track How does it feel when you turn around and look back Forty years, forty years to discover How to love How to understand each other And do you wonder where the time has gone It doesn't seem like Anything as long as forty years as forty years as forty years.
Jonathan, a beautiful song. So that, that's going to be the single on the new album, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, well, we, we might just um, have, pass on a little bit more information. That was a beautiful song. Oh, thank, thank you, you very thank much. You. I'm, I'm sure the listeners will be... Well, uh, my parents liked it. Uh, yeah, I'll bet. They thought I'll it was bet. lovely. Yeah, yeah. Um, let's, let me just give them a bit more information about yep. what's going on here. I've got a page here. You've got a page. Yeah. I'm going to get to you in a minute because we, we try yes. and do it chronologically. Start them. See, yes, so we've go. still got Friday. I've got something for Friday here. Um, and then we're going to get on to Saturday. So the Coffee and Culture event at the Yebo Art Studio on State Highway 2, next to the Tin Hut at uh, Turanikau, uh, hosted by our wonderful ceramic artist uh, Zelda Bruce. So this is um, it's called Coffee and Culture. It's uh, an entertaining and enlightening talk with Professor Roger Erickson, Roger was the art history professor at Adams State University in Colorado. He's now living in New Zealand. No wonder, he's a sensible fellow. He'll be talking about scandals in art history, while guests enjoy a selection of confectionery. Subsequently, there will be a complimentary tour of the Yabo Art Studio. So that's on tomorrow at 2 o'clock, and then on Saturday at uh, 2 o'clock. It's Friday the 27th, Saturday the 28th of November, 2 o'clock um, at the Yabo Art Studio, and there's a $28 admission. So that's money well spent, I think, supporting uh, Zelda and her artistic initiatives there. Well, tomorrow night, more competition for us at the Coco Dessert Bar, uh, Jonathan. Mm. There's the Roger Fox Big Band playing with Ray Wolf on vocals, yes. doing hits from the Brits. That's the 27th of November, 8.30 to 10.30. In fact, people could come to our event at Coco and then go on down to Carterton. You know, by the time Bob and Kate finish, quarter past eight, you'll be out of the Coco and down to the Carterton Event Centre. It's just going to cost you $63. That's I mean, that's slip. getting up there, isn't it? But then it is Roger Fox. He is our international jazz man, isn't he? He's pretty good. So what's he doing heading into Brit rock and roll, old pop rock and roll? That's a, that's a sideways. Uh, mm. I think it's probably the only only kind of vocals that Ray can manage. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm teasing. <laughs> It'll be a very lively show. I won't read out all all about it. But one of the, some of the songs they're doing are "You Really Got Me," "My Generation," "Keep On Running," and "A Hard Day's Night." Hits from the Brits, tomorrow night at the Carterton Event Centre, Roger Fox and Co. Um, Saturday, moving on to the weekend, we finally get there. The Greytown Town Hall is hosting the Hospice Wire Wrapper Christmas Fate uh, from 10 o'clock in the morning on Saturday the 28th and also from 10 o'clock on Sunday morning the 29th. Uh, Hospice Wairapa is thrilled to announce our incredibly successful Christmas fate is back. Unfortunately, due to certain constraints of COVID-19, it won't be accompanied by our usual country Christmas house tour, but it's such a wonderful event, crucial fundraising for the community hospice. So please get down there. There'll be about 30 stalls, stalls quality wares from local producers. Greytown Town Hall, Saturday and Sunday, 10 o'clock in the morning. Now we're moving on up to the North Wairapa. You know that our district uh, extends to Danavirk, Jonathan. Oh, We're giving information to people as far north Goodness from me. here as right. Danavirk yes, yes. and from as far south as Cape Palliser and now we. It's a fair stretch, yeah. yeah, yeah. So um, there is something very exciting happening on Sunday, the 29th. Uh, it's at the Tui Brewery. It's the Mangatanoka Vintage V Brexit V E U Car Day. So you're going to see a display of fantastic, wonderful, amazing old cars, and it's somehow a competition to see which is the most spectacular or the most loved of the cars from the eras of Vintage Brexit. And EU. So Brexit, I guess, are British cars, and EU will be European cars. So there might be the odd Merc, Ferrari, Maserati, Porsche, 
competing with Rover, Rover, <laughs> MG, uh, Austin. There might be Austin there. Anyway, my imagination is getting off on me. I should tell you when it's on. It's on Saturday, no, Sunday, 9.30, Sunday the 29th, 9.30 to 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And if you have one of those cars, you can also roll up, put a ticket on your windscreen, screen, and you'll be in the catalogue. That's me making that up, by the way. Um, also on the 29th of November, up north, is the Woodville Historic Gorge Cemetery Conducted Tour. Now, that's a mouthful, but it's worth me repeating it. The Woodville's Historic Gorge Cemetery Conducted Tour. And that's being organised by Joan on phone 0637656900. Hear the stories of some of the people who signed a testimonial to the first head teacher of Woodville School. And M.G. Crawford is involved with that. So that's something very exciting for Sunday, if you haven't got anything better to do. Go through uh, the Gorge Cemetery Conducted Tour in Woodville. I think it's time for some more music, Jonathan. Oh, very good. Uh, yes, I'll, I'll put you on next for the, oh, for the, for yes, the um, yes. uh, information. But let's have a go at 36 Oaks, shall we? Oh, very good, yes. So... We had hoped that uh, that Keith would be with us with his keyboard, but unfortunately he's got a cold this morning, um, and so so we haven't got him and we haven't got his keyboard. Uh, so I've got my fortunately I've got my sideways keyboard right here, uh, my portable one. Um, so I haven't really or much. Uh, sung this one with the accordion, but we'll find out how that goes. I mean, I we're jamming it. Yes, we yeah. are. Cool. Um, of course, I haven't actually sung it very much at all. The song's only about a day or two old, so. So this um, is hot off the press. Uh, pretty much, yeah. Now, where are these oak trees? Oh yeah, good point, good point. So this is a song uh, about thirty-six oak trees, and if you're a particular sort of local, you'll know perhaps what I'm talking about. Um, it's what's called the Mangaraki war memorial i'm um, actually very close to where i'm staying in uh gladstone or tafiti actually really just over the over the the boundary um it's a war memorial that uh for unusually enough for both first and second world war uh it was uh established in 1953 uh there are as it says 36 oak trees there are 24 for uh, people in the district who died in the First World War and 10 for those who died in the Second. Um, and if you're cunning at maths, you'll realise that only makes up 34 oak trees. So there are two extras um, and nobody knows why, but there they are. Um, it's a marvellous uh, avenue of trees, almost as if you're in France for about 200 metres leading up the hill to the, um, uh, to the memorial on, on the brow of the hill. It's, mm. it's very beautifully designed. And it's amazing driving through there in a storm like I did Ooh, last yeah. night. And suddenly there's a great crash on my windscreen. Oh, exciting. And, and a branch blew out of the top of the oak tree and yeah. came crashing down. Good and I've thought for sure the windscreen would crack or there'd be a dent in the roof. And there wasn't. Right. It was just like a kind of a knock from heaven, you know, a great big bump. What's going on, Rob? Yes. Well, yeah. and I thought, God needs to do I better, that to I better get answer attention. the question. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so I went and picked you up. <laughs> <laughs> How exciting. Goodness me. Oh, here's my chord. There we go. You'll play through the first line or two. Uh, well, yeah. so we'll do the we'll do the first chorus twice. I'll sing it once through, and then okay. you pile in the second time round, or something like that. Yeah. Thirty-six oak trees beside a country road. 
stand at attention, 67 years old, 24 for the first war, 10 for the second, and 2 to watch over them all. 36 oak trees beside a country road stand at attention 67 years old. 24 for the first war, ten for the second, and two to watch over them all. In 1914, then again in 39, from their farms, their homes, their trade. They said goodbye to everything they'd ever known Then they turned and walked away Thirty-six oak trees beside a country road Stand at attention Sixty-seven years old Twenty-four for the first war Ten for the second And two to watch over them all Ten And again in forty-five One by one That's right in 1918, then again in 45 One by one they did return Some were walking and some were carried home And some were never seen again Thirty-six oak trees beside a country road Stand at attention, sixty-seven years old Twenty-four for the first war, ten for the second, and two to one over them all They were scattered far and wide across the earth Every land and every sea In the desert in the fields and in the air But their names are gathered here. Thirty-six oak trees beside a country road stand at attention sixty-seven years old twenty-four for the first war for the second and two to watch over us all. Thirty-six oak trees beside a country road. Thirty-six
Jonathan, you must be very happy with that song. I'm kind of, yeah, I'm kind of happy with that one. In, 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 in its sort of uh, ponderous, um, uh, almost uh, melancholic. Oh, yes. But wonderful yes. tune, a wonderful tune. I do like tunes. Do you like a good tune? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's your turn. If I can, if I can uh, oh, interrupt. Oh yes, yes. Um, I think we'll just have a few more events, and then we'll finish off with your last song. Right. Very good. You've got the list there I on the top. I do have the list. I have the list right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I'm inferring that top left is Monday because it comes before Tuesday. Is that yeah, correct? Right. Yes. Yeah. Brilliant. And these are the ones that have the pen indications beside them. Is that correct? Yes. Right. So, Monday evening uh, is the Carterton Scottish Dance Club. 7.30pm, uh, yep. Carterton School Hall, Holloway Road. No partner required. They will fit you up. Call Elaine, 377-0322, or email carterton at dancescottish.org.nz. So get your kilt and get down to the Carterton School Hall Monday evening. Or, if you prefer, well, you can do this too, because this is in the morning. This is watercolour for beginners. Uh, there's a class at the Masterton Art Club in Victoria Street, 10 a.m. to noon. Call Alyssa Smith, uh, on 027-470-6528 and she will tell you what to do and where to bring. I don't think you need to bring your own water. No, uh, or paint. Or paint, probably. Or brushes. Maybe not even brushes but or possibly paper. possibly paper. But maybe your creative sensibility. Yes, yes. Uh, your yes. profound response to the environment yes. around you. Or maybe your desire to be creative. Anyway, yeah. uh, you can also go to the Free Community Fit Club. This is at 6 a.m. if you're keen, or 11 a.m. if you're normal, uh, at Carrington Park in Carterton. All ages, all fitness levels. Call Di on 27 So you could do all three of these things on Monday if you want a busy Monday. Yes, yes. Then on Tuesday, we have the Martinborough Community Choir. If you were at the Tin Hut last Friday, you could have heard what they did. It was a fabulous set. So this is Tuesday night, 7.15 to 9 p.m. at the First Church Hall. Don't go to the Second Church. First Church Hall in Weld Street, Martinborough. An unauditioned, all-comers, primary, primarily a cappella choir. And contact Vic Jones. Uh, that's Vic B. Jones, all one word, at gmail.com. This is the Martinborough Community Choir. How can and you resist and they're now performers and if they weren't performers. before last friday yes they're now out there they're known fabulous about. set yep. they did uh just before that uh there is dance fitness uh 6 30 to 7 p.m this is still tuesday at fairham house hall in featherston and you can call justine 0204 105 2830 and she will tell you all about that so that's dance fitness but if you're feeling a bit more sedate there's also chair fitness this is gentle chair exercises 2 to 2 45 p.m at st john's hall in Greytown. your chair will never have felt fitter um at the South Wairarapa Working Men's Club this is still Tuesday evening we have a games afternoon doesn't say what time, but I'm guessing it's in the afternoon. Yeah, yeah. All uh, afternoon. You can play cards or board games or darts or pool. Call uh, DOF on 3049748. Yeah. Uh, then if you're feeling particularly ruthless, there is the Carrington Bowling and Crokey Club. Association <laughs> Crokey, 9 a.m. for 9.15 start. So be there on time. Yeah. Call Robin Brazel, 0622-4000. Or bowls, 1.20 p.m. for 1.30 p.m. start, so be there on time at the club rooms beneath the clock tower in Carterton. Call Rex Kenny, 379-7303, or the Masterton Crokey Club. Golf Crokey, 9.15 a.m. behind the Hosking Garden in the park. So call Russell Ward, 377-4401. On Wednesday, it's a rich feast for you. 
There is the Rock and Roll Dance Class, 7.30 to 8.30 p.m. Wednesday. Beginners or couple coaching, social competitive, call Wendy, 27 319 You've always wanted to do it. Now is your chance, or specifically on Wednesday. You've got six days to prepare. Um, Heart of Arts Wider Rapper. Community Gallery showing work from Wairarapa artists, 47 High Street in Carterton. That's Wednesday to Sunday, 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. Uh, then, uh, at 1 to 3 p.m., in Featherston Community Centre, there is the Silver Ukulele Club. I thought you'd like this. Yes, I don't know if they, you have to have a silver ukulele, but there is a silver ukulele club called Jan 0630885566, and she will tell you whether your ukulele needs to be silver. And there's a photograph of these guys in um, event on the event finder. Oh, very good. And there's very about good. there's about fifteen or twenty of them, all ages, looking quite smart, Sounds standing like up with their crowd. ukuleles. Mm. So they're ready to rock, I think. Yes. So that's Wednesday at one to three p.m. The Fako no Fako Ori Ori Shufflers Line Dancing Red Star yeah. Club Rooms Herbert Street Masterton Improvers are five to six thirty p.m. The intermediates are 5.30 to 7 p.m. They've got more stamina. I see there's no class for deteriorators. That's possibly a good thing. Call 377-5518 or, if you prefer, 377-1135 for line dancing on Thursday evening at 5.30. Uh, then the Rangatahi to Rangatira Youth Group. Join us for sports, food and leadership. That's at the Carterton Events Centre. Uh, and for information, text R2R to 027 742 uh, And finally, on Wednesday evening, uh, it doesn't say what time, but I'm guessing it's the evening, uh, is the Wire Rapper Singers. Choral singing with at least two performances each year. We heard one on Saturday. If you were lucky to be there, it was fabulous. Uh, based in Masterton. Call Sean Mulcahy, 379-9316. You know you want to. Thank you, Jonathan Golly. You're going to do me out of a job here. <laughs> you're, you're a natural. <laughs> How much radio that. experience have you had? Oh, I don't know, about um, 10 minutes. 10 minutes. <laughs> you're a natural. <laughs> hey, any, anyway, it's lovely having you here. We're going to get to your song in a minute. Yep. But I do have a couple of announcements that are important. One is the Christmas Parade in Carterton. Ooh. Exciting. Yeah, tomorrow, uh, Saturday from 11 o'clock. Saturday the 28th of November, 11 o'clock. And it's going to be a busy parade. Um, have a look in the midweek if you want to get the information about all the things that are coming in the Christmas parade in Carterton on Saturday. Stalls, music, street party in the back, in the park, sorry, after uh, after the parade, entertainment, even emergency services in case you get too carried away. The theme is red and green. Uh, there are going to be spot prizes uh, with a prize giving in the afternoon, floats, all that sort of thing. And it's, remember, it's Christmas. So who could not have fun? One other um, event that's coming up. Oh, I should tell you about the farmer's market in Masterton at Solway at the showgrounds under the grandstand and outside that's on Saturday as well uh, a little bit competing with the Christmas fair in Carterton but if you get there at nine o'clock then you can get on down to Carterton at 11 uh, and there will be some wonderful musicians playing there uh, in, in, on Saturday morning and that's notably Keith and myself uh, we, we love to play there and I, I, I think we um, get away with it Sometimes we're a bit loud, but that's uh, Saturday morning until one o'clock, and the and the the stalls are amazing. There's there's a few more being added each week. Uh, there's olive oil. There's lovely food. There's coffee. Lots of plants. Some crafts. Some lovely woolly socks. All that sort of thing. And lovely people having a good time. Um, so the last bit of information I'm going to give you this morning before we head into our last song is about the um, what's happening in the Masterton Library. Um, the summer reading. This is the program from December through January. Just remember that we have a library and uh, they're wonderful places to pop in for, for an hour, hour and a half and catch up with 
magazines, newspapers, find your favorite book, uh, have a chat with someone quietly. Um, so the summer reading starting uh, Monday the 23rd of November, that was um, this week. Uh, the sensory story time starts first week in December. Um, there's a, a quiet hour, hour between 9 and 10. Story time with Santa, that starts on the 9th of December at 11 o'clock. Uh, family story time, 10.30, that's from these, on the 16th and the 30th of December and the 13th of January. The, these uh, events are worth finding out about. Just pop into the library or give them a ring. Phone number 06370-6253 and you can find out the programs on offer. Golly, we talk a lot, don't we, Jonathan? Yes, we do, we yeah. do. So you yes. want to tell us about this last oh, song? Oh, yeah, well, there's not much to say. Hang on, just let me get my um, vertical piano on. Um, it's called um, the Op Shop Song because I love op shops. There are two op shops in Carterton, so far as I can tell. Um, this is indiscriminately about both of them. But it is fair to say that uh, the objects referenced uh, in the chorus... Um, every word of this is true, uh, are items that I actually did purchase at uh, one of the op shops in the region. So this song, uh, unlike the other one, does have a happy ending. Have you got your chart there? Yep. Cool. Yep. Um, also, yeah, this is, this is a thoroughly alarming experience, partly because I'm trying to play this on accordion rather than piano, and partly because the song came into existence, uh, well, the second verse uh, came into existence about one o'clock this morning. So um, it's all very, very brand new. Let's see how this works. And give me a hut when we go to the bridge. Uh, yes, I will do, do that. will do the verse, chorus, and then so verse. verse. So it goes to the verse, then there's a chorus, then there's a verse into the chorus, then straight into the bridge. Cool. But I will um, try to indicate that possibly by saying something like, Bridge! <laughs> Let's see how we go. I'll, I'll just start with a... Walking one day through the mean streets of Carterton The wind came up and the rain poured down Ducked through a lighted doorway conveniently near When I looked around I saw treasures everywhere you could find a book that could change your life A coffee mug that'll feel just right You could find a candle for to give you light You can find music to keep you dancing through the night Keep you dancing through the night Crockery glasses and ages of kitchenware Anything you could want, it's all right here A beautiful lounge suite from 1973 Anything behind the cushions and it's yours for free You could find a book That could change your life A coffee mug That'll feel just right You could find a candle That to give you light you can find music to keep you dancing through the night Music to keep you dancing through the night Bridge, I'm putting on a dead man's shirt A dead man's tie A dead 
dead man's suit Zipping up a dead man's fly A dead man's hat A dead man's coat Walking out of here In a dead man's shoes Cause I found a book That could change my life a coffee mug That'll feel just right I've got missing candles For to give me light And I've got music To keep me dancing through the night Music to keep me dancing through the night Dancing through the night. Whoa. <laughs> Jonathan, that's a fantastic song. And the nice thing about your songs is they're all a bit different. Oh, yeah. Th there's, yeah. Not, there's not a Jonathan Burkham sort of uh impulse it's it, it it well there is and it's it's the, the variety of it yeah i, I think it's yeah. important to be a kind of moving target basically. yeah i was going to say not a jonathan birkin sound yes exactly you know right. you're you're wonderfully varied mm. and that piano accordion that's a beautiful instrument oh, it's isn't a great it? beast my isn't goodness great? Yes. so we're going to go out now i'm going to say goodbye to you all uh we're going to go out with um uh, a song by Wayne Mason in his oh, band, yeah. The Fallen Angels. This is The Last Dance. And we're going to see you next week, folk. Uh, have a wonderful time. Like a breath upon the neck of me Like the rays playing over the sea Like a furtive kiss of delicacy Nothing ventured, nothing gains I've done it all and I've received the pain The strands are broken one by one When I breathe synchronize I lay a soul below inside It's the last dance for dreams and hopes It's the last time
So that's Wayne Mason and Fallen Angels with a lovely song from his album Since Got Out, The Last Dance. It's track one. And of course, Wayne with Formula did that wonderful song Nature way back. And he's been um, kind of on the on the go ever since as a, as a wonderful contributor to New Zealand and international music, put us on the map. Uh, and a wonderful keyboard player. Uh, who tours with uh, Laura Collins at times and her band, the Back Porch Blues Band, who come into the Warapper occasionally. Um, anyway, thanks, Wayne. And thanks, everybody, for listening. This is Move, Mingle and Play. Uh, my, your host, uh, Rob Mansell, my privilege to be with you for this hour. See you next week.